Hello, Lady OS viewers. You all are welcome back to Lady OS Home of News. My people, I thank every one of you for watching my video, for sharing my video. My people, I bring this update. Come, make we listen to this update. Make we like the video, share the video, put your comment for the comment section. If you never subscribe for this my channel, do me a favor and subscribe and press the bell so that if I drop down, you'll be the first person to. Okay, yeah, go to that office. Okay. When you enter that office, you say, okay, uh, that car, we are going to pay cash for you. And uh, this is how much you are going to, we are going to gain on your head every month. Okay. While you are paying social so amount for the next uh, two, three years, uh, blah, blah. Depending on negotiation, if you want to pay faster, they are going to reduce the years and the money will get higher. Okay. After that, you know the next thing? You go go where they sell house. Where did he sell house? Now, when I met abroad, though, remember, say, I seen a 10,000, I'm not talking at 10,000 shekel, I'm with their um, salary, but I'm just using as example. Now, it's going to go to, uh, where did he sell house? Brand new house, two bedroom flat, three bedroom flats, okay. How much is this bedroom flat every month? Um, you're going to pay for 20 years, 25 years. Remember that 25 years where they talk or 20 years, you go pay them until when that time we don't retire. Now that time you don't pay finish. They go to come out the money, small, small. You don't get new car, you don't get new house. House, now car that they change. After you don't use that car for almost a certain time, you see another one way like you go go meet them. Say, I want to buy, I want to buy the other one. Ah, is the other one. Ah, they go collect them for hand. They go give them another one. You go add money. Now profit. They go carry that one where don't they use like one and a half years or so. Carry and go put for second hand. Where did they sell? <laughs> this is how life is abroad. Remember, out of that small money, chicken money, did they pay medical insurance every month? Whether you go hospital, you don't go hospital. Any day where emergency happen, they are taking you to the best hospital in the world to save your life. Now we they support Nigeria, support Nigeria. Look at what is happening in Abuja. Unano said they arrest somebody in Abuja. They, they kidnap one man and has six children. Have you? Listen to this. I'll be back. Worthless book that uh, Femi no additional published recently there is something about ipob also stated there in fact femi no additional confirmed that unam dekano was a real problem for not just for bukwario but for everyone around him to the point that they considered killing him. Let's kill him. They used the military. Somehow that failed. Then they initiated international, sort of a worldwide assassination hunt of Unam Dikano. Then he said, at a point, they felt like. Mm, let's just kidnap him and keep him. Maybe that will discourage all these young egos to continue to demand for Biafra. Baba, they hatched an operation, a plan inside the asshole rock on Dabokwari to kill Unamdekan. And why? I'll tell you. You know, a lot of uh, egos today, eh, in particular, and Nigerians in general, through the Unamdekanus uh, broadcasts, the ones that they pretended that they were not listening to until we realized that uh, the establishment actually wanted him dead and anyone associated with him killed or jailed. 
initially when it was like it started majority of the Igbos today that are now more interested in their position in Nigeria and upon discovering that there is already ongoing cold war unwritten cold war that cold war right that is uh, putting a target on every person that is an Igbo even if you were across or across the Niger even if you are not Igbo my brother, many Igbo no know. As long as you just day, they chop three times a day. No, 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 they don't believe whatever you're saying, my brother. You are Yoruba man. That they don't actually believe. Probably that man they arrested, they kidnapped in Abuja six, six daughters. And the man, they kidnapped him eight hours. Even the police came, they could not save them. In Abuja, go and Google it. And listening to it, probably I'm going to pl play that man for you through this brother. There is this unwritten cold war after the end of the genocidal war of uh, 1963 to 1970. Unam made so many egos themselves to realize that wow, we never saw it that way. They started questioning their position in Nigeria and every time they attempted it they met a brick wall that started making sense to them that this is a systemic profiling it is there in the system nobody can explain it they can give you different different excuses so why they hate the Igbos why the Igbos must be this why the Igbos must be that because it is systemic a lot of Igbos discovered that and they felt I mean they started Kind of realizing that they are better off without nigeria i mean a lot of them felt what broken like while others felt like unam dikanu was misleading the young people and it could lead to another war Igbo, so this is not like outsiders now i'm talking about Igbos who felt personally at the early stage that uh, unam dikanu's uh, messages only get the Igbos, especially the young ones, angrier at Nigeria. And the more angrier they get, there is likelihood that they are going to pick up arms and decide that they want to leave Nigeria. And in fact, conclude, I mean, complete what uh, their own uh, parents couldn't do or complete at the time. So there are Igbos who feared that. So therefore, they automatically became enemies of Unamdikan and anything like POB. They called them different names. And these were the willing tools in the hands of the likes of Bokuari to stage the state sponsored terrorism of eight solid years in eastern Nigeria that still continues to today. Thousands of young people have been killed. A lot have disappeared. Many are in jail as we speak right now on that bogus crop boss uh, charges. Systemic profiling. So it worked for a while. And then uh, Bokwari started failing. I mean, Bokwari said uh, jihadism, tribalism. You know, bigotry, they started manifesting. I mean, it became so obvious that uh, it wasn't hard for Unam Dikano's message and messages to travel far and beyond. For the remaining five of them, elderly people call into this show they cry they pour out their pains you know from you know a man in abuja the the, the place where supposed to be the most safest place in nigeria as a capital a civil servant six daughter and the man and they demand millions listen I don't understand. I don't understand. It's very, very sad, you know. 
No way. I would like us to quickly uh, get another caller quickly before I can come back to the panel so that we can have our final say. You know, thank you very much, Mother Tammy, for uh, calling us. You know, please, I'd like you to talk to us. Mother Tammy, can you hear me? Happy Sunday, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Happy, happy Sunday to you, ma'am. Please talk to us. Thank you. I uh, what I want to say, first of all, is that uh, those girls, uh, they kidnap, it's really touching and, you know, it's heartbroken and, you know, killing her, I'm sure, in presence of our other sisters, that trauma, if they come out alive, it will never leave, they won't forget it. And I will say we don't have government, I keep saying it every day. We don't have government, we don't have government. With these people, we don't have government. They are not after the, the citizens, they are after their own pocket. Their own children are not in Nigeria. Their children are outside. So... Did you hear that? Not be from me, or not from the people, or from people. But when I go to bash me, this is Nigerian media, TV station. Go Just ahead. Amongst the money, take it to themselves. And no security, nothing. That's why uh, 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 last week I was angry with that police officer that was trending about no grief. I said they need to go and go for legal training. That is not the job of police. Did you know how much they demand from that man? 65 million. Not 1 million, not 2 million, not 3 million, no 5 million. With communication. You see, I'm not good at all this programming. I thought if the thing why I go they do for this place, they show now. When I go watch and finish, when I go they cry. But I'm not too good. I know they're too good. If I'm too good, I go they, now so I go take my time. They compile all those messages, come the show now, they play them like this. When I go they take, when I go they cry like this. Make I tell you now. The bandit that you see so a government and they are yes they are making look at that amount of money yeah nigerian people now go to nature they kill they kill one of the daughter they kill their sister right in front of them and they are still going to collect that 65 million police is to secure the citizens protect them and properties what is no grief it's just a slogan the youth are using to encourage themselves. The condition is really, really bad. Really bad in our country. We don't have a country. So, 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 so sorry about it. We don't have a country. We don't have government. The government are not there for us. They are there for themselves. I, I, I... Listen to him. If he cry, finish. He goes, still say Nigeria is my country. Everything is going to be all right. Oh, idiot, go he will never support freedom. No, mm -mm. a lot of them don't want freedom. They are just afraid. And people like this are not. See, now I tell you, people will know. Category of people will know they like about freedom. Or when we say, not be said they don't know what be the right thing. They say, ah, what category are we going to fall into? Me, I'm from. Uh, what you know the column? All this uh, not 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 east. North East, all those categories way far for North East. If you go all those other North East, I go see say that they speak Yoruba there. They not be Awusa people. You go check and say, hey, which one one Nigeria self these people they talk about? Where are we going? Which category are we going to front? Like the Benin people. Benin people go tell you say, inside their mind say which category Nigeria one Nigeria. Oh. Ah, come on, not be this Igbo, I beg. They fall into those propaganda, letting them believe that Igbo people are bad. They are so bad people. If you find out that somebody is bad, you banish the people that are bad. That's what you're supposed to do as African. You banish them. So I banish you now from Nigeria. Go and have your own state. That's how to treat bad people. I am so, so, so touching with that. For that young lady to die before the time. That's all the time God said she would die. They just cut short all her destiny, everything. And these people know where they are. They are the ones sponsoring them. They are the ones putting them into our military. Most of our real military, are, they've killed them. 
Our real police, they are not. It's all these people they are putting in there because we don't. If not Simon Ekpa talker now, and I will say, make you shut up there. Get out of there. You are in Finland. You enjoy yourself in Finland. The last people we're supposed to fight for freedom now, people where they are brought, not even like Simon. Now, those of us where they will be saying, we don't get our bearing. There are thousands of Nigeria in Italy, we don't get their bearing. There are thousands of Nigeria in Germany, we don't get their bearing. Excuse me. Give me a moment, please. I'll be back. Surprisingly, that was just a few months after Bukwari took government that they felt offended. By December 2015, Bukwari's government kidnapped Namdekanu in Lagos. They were now looking for what to charge him with. Terrorism. Uh, sedition. They should have found all kinds of things they could charge him with. Eventually, none of them could stick. But they, had, they got a good reason. So now mobilize the Nigeria military, DSS, and other murderous agents in uniform to Eastern Nigeria, not just that. Across Nigeria, Igbo businesses continue to take serious economy, I mean serious uh, what you call it, economic policies, uh, ash economic policies that continue to destroy and affect their business. This is like systemic. Every time. That soon they cannot turn his camera on. More and more unbelievers. They were tuning in. They just wanted to understand Nigeria. And that was how his messages traveled, even beyond Igbo land. Beyond. And that was the real threat they didn't tell you. Apart from finding an excuse of killing the Igbos, using Namdekanu's uh, messages and positions as an excuse yeah they were worried that if the way this guy was going it won't just be the egos that are going to turn out rebellious young young people in nigeria they started tuning in listening to understand who was really wrong with nigeria a lot of them were so surprised that did that really happen are you are you serious is that did that happen I never knew that. Oh, I no, they took our history out of curriculum. Hmm? I never knew until Mazi Namdekanu began to preach. Like, are you serious? Who is Lord Lugard? Who are all those people? He really opened our eyes. Even as much as many people are still opening their eyes, they still just believe that, oh, everything is done. Nigeria is going to be okay. Oh, don't worry. If it's not okay in our generation, it's going to be okay in another generation. My brother, it's not going to be okay until... You see, we're talking about Pan-African. Pan-Africanism doesn't mean that we cannot have our space. We are looking on a way to liberate Africa. I saw somebody on social media who said, uh, uh, giving Igbo, uh, getting IPOB is not Pan-Africanism. Are you all right? No. No. Europe are Europeans. All of them are European from Germany to Italy down to Australia. They all have their space and they are all Europeans. African as Pan-Africanism or Pan-Africans. If we come together in Africa, come on guys. It doesn't matter that you cannot flog with your with, 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 with bed of your feather. Bed of your feathers, look at the animal in the sky. How many species of bed do we have? How many species of monkeys do we have in the jungle? You see the species of monkeys flock together. Babu goes together. You go there, are several thousands of monkeys in the forest. Even cockroach. You will never see a species, a, a, a particular a species of cockroach with another one. Never. That's how God created it. People of the same feather flock together. We are not much. 